just out running and I've ran about 3k's out and I've just come to the tip I would say so you can't really go any further there's caravan park there and it goes a little bit further around but nothing too much but so quiet palm trees birds some really nice old school homes and then you've got the water the ocean is on the other side so peaceful out here. Maybe because it's 6.30 in the morning, but it's really nice so far. The caravan park that we're seeing at isn't on the water like this one. Uh, I don't remember why we didn't stay at this one, but when we get when I get back, I'll ask Nick. So, the caravan park that we're staying at is literally where the UR here is. Straight across the road at the Captain Cook Holiday Village. And I just ran and took you guys, sorry about my finger there, all the way up and around up to this little loop thing here which is where that 1770 campground is that i showed you you can go a little bit further around but nothing too much and obviously this is surrounded by the ocean and then the river that i took you past and if you head down this way back along the road heading out of town you'll get to agnes waters which is this area so there's a little bit to do around here it's just a nice quiet little town but yeah, so far it's been really enjoyable. It is very warm. We woke up at 6am and it was already 27 degrees. So it gets quite warm here in the summer. Whilst in 1770, we are staying at the Captain Cook Holiday Village. So it's a really good campsite. It's actually quite big. Um, we drove around it last night when we got in, but they have a really cool fish and chip shop just down there. Um, they've got an Australia Post, free Wi-Fi, you're allowed dogs, camping, there's cabins that you can see this one just behind that car. They've got a swimming pool and yeah, powered sites are really good. The amenities, we're staying right next to the laundry. So there's a nice little laundry if you need to top up on there and free Wi-Fi, which is really good. Um, especially out here in 1770. You definitely don't get anything with Vodafone and we get a little bit of service with our Telstra so that free Wi-Fi makes a huge difference. It is also a good a members rewards um, partnership, or it has one sorry. So if you've paid your membership for a good a, you also get to use it here. just put the tinny on the trailer as you can probably hear the aircon it's pretty warm outside um so nick was setting it up and i went for a run so it's all oh you can't see because that's closed it's all done now uh we're just gonna have quick showers and we're gonna head into the boat ramp and nick wants bacon and egg rolls which we don't have yet so we're gonna grab him one of those at the boat ramp instead of cooking this morning all right, we're ready to go down the boat ramp, and we're gonna get what are we gonna get? You want bacon and eggs? Yeah, some bacon and eggs. Um, the tin is on the car. I'll spin around here. I'll show you here quick. Oh, go out here. Yeah, the tin is on, ready to go. So we're all ready to go. The fishing gear is in the tinny. I got to rig up some rods when we get out there, but that's all right. Um, and we are ready to go. We're just going to go up the estuary um, here at 1770. I'll put up on the screen a map of that off my Navionics app. We don't have a screen or sounder on this boat at the moment. Um, we didn't get there <laughs> in the big rush, but we will be putting one on in the future. But for now, I just use my phone, Navionics app. It is the go. Yeah, 
and he's ready to go. at this jellyfish that we've just spotted. I'm supposed to be driving, but I'm too busy filming, so Nick's laughing at me. <laughs> when you don't know which one to do more, should I film or should I drive? Definitely drive. <laughs> I also have a camera. So Beck is fishing. Oh, she's on. No, it's not. Oh, what, what was that? Huh? There's a little bank through here, just like through this section here. You can see it in sunglasses, and it must have all these little flathead on it. Just jig it, like give it a little couple of tugs. Is that it? Oh, <laughs> oh my God. No, not there now. Just let it, let it drop again. Just let, let, like just let it sit there. That's it. There you go. Oh. You got it? No, it's not on again. Just leave it. Do you get a little bit? Like, just move it a little bit? Oh, it is on. Is it on? It's on there. It's on. I actually caught a fish. My poor car. <laughs> Look how baby. It's such a big one. It's a baby. That's why I can feel it. <laughs> Small one, but she still caught a fish. Here you go. It's bloody eating it. Hey, good job. Right in my face. <laughs> right, now that we have both caught all the funny, we're going to yeah. head back in. Head back in and head back in and then we're heading to the today. Yeah, so we're going to head up north. As I was saying earlier, the place that I ran to this morning that we just showed you, you can also hire um, like kayaks and paddle boards and do that sort of thing if you don't have a tinny. I think there would maybe be a tinny hire over at the boat ramp but there is also an aqueduct type of thing it's like a bus that goes into the water yeah. which is pretty cool so there's a few things you can do here with the family definitely an awesome spot to swim in these little shallows with the kids We packed up and put the tinny on the roof. This is somewhere we'll definitely go back. This is a problem with only having a small time frame to travel. We would 100% like to stay at 1770 longer, but we must move on to Yapoon. We have packed everything up and we're ready to go. We only have to disconnect the power and pop it down. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. 
deck is backing the car up for the hitch. Right. Right. Good sir. Hard. Go forward. Sorry, my bad. Okay, come back, right? Yeah, like that. Off you are. Keep going, a little bit. Keep coming. Keep coming. Right hand down. Yeah. Stop. And I think we'll get it. Yeah, we're all good. We have packed up the van and the tinny and we are ready to go. Yeah, we're ready to go. It is so hot. It's really hot. It says it's 30 degrees, but I think it's a bit hotter than that. It's gonna be hot, so we're going to head into 1770 and we're going to go to a lookout, which I think is called Bastard Bay Lookout. Yeah, it's called Bastard, Bastard Bay. Bay Lookout. So we're going to head there now and we might have some lunch because it's 11.45 and we're hungry. <laughs> we are at... Russell's anchor. Yeah, little lookout. Get the van parked up. Bex tripping on flat ground. <laughs> I don't know how far this one is. Oh. Figure it's it like out. 35 degrees. It's so hot. Hang on, fix this camera. It's so hot. And I have a t shirt on. Don't ask why. Okay, there's a t shirt on. I've taken my singlet off. Got our water. Still haven't eaten today, have we? No, we've had some cookies, but it's too hot to eat. Yeah, we had a four Anzac biscuits, a Snickers, some lollies, <laughs> a coffee. We're going to uh, have some, um, what do you call it, salsa and chips Chips after. Yeah. Oh, I think this is just an anchor. It's not a lookout. Yeah, it's a big anchor. Let's read it. It's What's it say? This anchor was restored oh. in April 2005 as a community service project by 1770 Action Group Incorporated with generous assistance from Bottle Paints, Bundaberg Sandblasting and Roof and Spot. Marion Vale Shire Cancel. It's a big anchor. <laughs> pretty much. There's a little track around here. It's pretty nice. I don't know if you've ever you guys have any beat uh, da, 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 da. if you guys have ever been here. But it's quite hilly and there's some big houses up here on the hill. Um, yeah pretty nice look out. Might be something down here. Let's have a look. Okay, we just came down to this little hill past the anchor. What do you reckon? We definitely have the bright high shoes on. Bex got her boots on, ready to go. Oh, it's a nice little beach. People must come surf down here or something. Don't yeah, know. Down could go down. Probably fish off those rocks, I guess you could. Yeah. Flick out there somewhere. Nice, right, eh? Yeah. We're up at Bastard Bay Lookout now. Sorry if you can't hear me on the wind. There's all little tracks everywhere. Pip must go down there fishing. There must be fish down there on the point. And I think that's the inlet there to my to our left, like just over that way. What do you reckon, back? Hot? Very nice. It's hot, but it's very nice. Yeah, it's nice. It's so good. Anyway, we're gonna trek up around there, maybe out to that little platform there. Let's see how we go. It's probably like 35 today. A bit of wind, probably eight knots. Anyway. Ooh. We're walking around to Bastard Bay. There's been a couple of people down on the rocks um, fishing and all that sort of stuff. Throw a big popper off there, I reckon. <laughs> Jokes, I got no idea. Anyway, we are heading <laughs> around this way. What's that sign say? Don't jump off. <laughs> There's another truck down there. It opens up. It's a little rocky outcrops. So you could go down there and have a look, I guess. Not on that way. So we made it. Good Boston Bay lookout. Seating area. And yeah, nice look out. There's a good breeze, which is good, eh? It's so nice, it's so nice breeze. It's like aircon. The water is so blue. Yeah. It's so nice. Just gonna hang out here for a bit, aren't we? Yeah. Should have oh. got our lunch here. Yeah. 
We didn't know how far the walk would be though. Alright, we'll check back in when we're back in the car. We just got back to the car from our little hike and we're going to have some corn chips and salsa. Yeah, go on. And I just had to book the next two nights accommodation because it actually didn't work the last time we did. So luckily we checked and they had a site available. Yeah. But that was a little bit of a, oops, I thought I did it way back in October and yeah. I just checked the it's confirmation fine. and it wasn't there. So But anyways. We are heading to Yapoon now, so yep. stay tuned for next week's episode and we'll be in Yapoon. Yeah, we'll be in Yapoon, Five Rocks and a couple other spots. So thanks for watching guys. We hope you enjoyed this one. Don't forget to leave a like and if you want to see more, subscribe.